what do you do when things go terribly wrong at exactly the wrong time? Like, let's say you're putting on an expensive three-day in-person workshop. You've got a room full of people who are depending on you to be there and be at your best and serve them like crazy. And you get a monster case of insomnia and you don't sleep but maybe an hour the night before day two, the most crucial day of the whole event. What do you do? What happens? That's what we're here to talk about today. So I kind of stressed about the fact that I could not go to sleep last night. This was day two of our three-day Build Your Platform event. People are counting on me to serve them at the highest possible level, and I'm committed to serving them at the highest possible level, and I could not sleep. I had a monster case of insomnia. I was wandering the halls of the Davenport Hotel here in Spokane at two o'clock in the morning looking for food. The only food I could find was peanut brittle, which kind of blew my whole keto thing for the night. But I was hungry. So I learned one valuable lesson from that. That is, be prepared, bring food of your own that's healthy for you to eat. Don't rely on the hotel to supply that. The second thing I learned was a matter of trust. I, I just prayed this morning and ask God, I need your grace to cover me because I am physically not able to do today. And somehow, I was imbued with the strength and the energy to serve them at the highest possible level. God showed up for me and through me and for these individuals and through them. And there was a huge note of grace on the whole event because Right before lunch, one of our attendees, John C. Morgan, who is the preeminent George Bush impersonator, yes, there is such a thing, uh, he came to me, because he was in the workshop participating, but he came to me and said, I'd like to offer a gift, if I may. I'd love to do an impromptu performance for the other folks who are here at the workshop. So this was incredible. This was an astonishing and gracious and generous gift and I want to share it with you. So here is John C. Morgan, AKA former President George W. Bush. This is a little song that I borrowed from uh, the great late songwriter Leonard Cohen, but I put my own lyrics to it. And so ladies and gentlemen, I give you Ode to Donald Trump. a man, his name is Trump, he kicked my baby brother's rump, but you don't really care for politics, do you? But you hung in tough, you took the cake, your strategy is to make us great, misunderstandation never threw you, hallelujah. Join 
me on the last refrain. Hallelujah. 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 Wow. That was a knockout performance. Everybody loved it. Uh, John was a huge hit. And he did not know I was going to do this, but just in case you need uh, somebody to perform, entertain, and inspire at your next event, I definitely encourage you to check out John C. Morgan. Uh, you can find his link to his website in the notes below this video. Be sure and click on that link and check out his work. Um, if nothing else, you might want to take a look at his book about the war on fear, which is huge, powerful. And I'd certainly recommend having him entertain at your next event. He is a star in every sense of the word. And he's very humble and gracious at the same time. So, what are my lessons for you today? I, I don't even know. I, I Just trust God, trust people, love people, serve hard, and things will work out. That's my lesson for today. If you have a thought on this, I'd love to hear you share. Um, I'm always looking forward to reading your comments and ideas and suggestions and hearing your stories. So put those below. I do read them all. I'll eventually get caught up on responding to all the, the comments. I've, I've been a little bit behind the last couple of days, but hopefully you can understand. I will get to them. I have read them all. And um, yeah, so leave me a message. And I'll see you tomorrow in the next video.